the Apple Watch Ultra 3 is finally on the horizon. And it's not just the next iteration in Apple's growing lineup of wearables. It's a symbol of how far wearable technology has come and where it's headed next. For nearly two years, Apple Watch Ultra enthusiasts have waited for something more than minor tweaks and subtle enhancements. And now, it appears Apple is prepared to deliver a meaningful leap forward. This isn't about small updates or marketing tricks. The Ultra 3 is shaping up to be Apple's boldest, smartest, and most rugged wearable ever released. It's being developed not just as a tool for health and fitness tracking, but as an essential life assistant for the modern adventurer, professional, and tech-savvy user who refuses to compromise. According to multiple reports and supply chain leaks, Apple is gearing up to launch the Ultra 3 in September 2025, likely alongside the iPhone 17 lineup and Apple Watch Series 11. But make no mistake the Ultra 3 is not just another companion to the iPhone. It's evolving into a category-defining device in its own right, with new features like two-way satellite texting, blazing fast 5G support, a redesigned wide-angle old display, a next-generation S10 or S11 chip, longer battery life and potentially game-changing health sensors like blood pressure monitoring. This is the most complete smartwatch Apple has ever built. Satellite texting, in particular, is poised to be revolutionary. This isn't just an emergency SOS system. Apple is aiming to create a seamless experience where users can send basic messages, update their location, or alert a trusted contact hall without a cellular signal or Wi-Fi connection. Think about what that means. You could be deep in the mountains on a solo camping trip, in the middle of the ocean, or even on a cross-country bike ride through remote territory and still have the ability to communicate. This kind of feature instantly elevates the Ultra 3 beyond being just a lifestyle product. It becomes a safety net, a backup lifeline, and a must-have tool for travelers, explorers, and emergency responders. The satellite functionality also signals Apple's broader ambitions in global connectivity. Over the past few years, Apple has partnered with satellite providers like Global Star to integrate emergency SOS capabilities into iPhones. But bringing it to the watch represents a whole new level of independence. And with 5G finally arriving on the Apple Watch Ultra, connectivity speeds will drastically improve across the board. That means faster app sensing, better real-time map updates, quicker Siri responses, and smoother music streaming directly from the watch even in densely populated or signal-congested areas. For users who train in urban jungles or need a connection on the go, this is a meaningful update. Beyond connectivity, display improvements are set to make the Ultra 3 more usable and vivid in every possible condition. The current Ultra models already offer excellent outdoor visibility, but the next generation OLED panel in Ultra 3 is expected to deliver higher peak brightness, wider viewing angles, and a more fluid always-on refresh rate thanks to LTPO technology. This will benefit divers who operate in murky waters, runners under direct sunlight, and mountaineers navigating snow-covered paths. Whether it's glancing at your heart rate, following a route, or simply checking the time, the screen will be more readable and responsive in any scenario. And then there's performance. Apple's new S10 chip or possibly an S11 depending on production timelines is expected to bring a dramatic boost to processing speed efficiency. And on device machine learning, this upgrade won't just make your watch snappier. It will allow Apple to integrate more advanced AI features including personalized health insights, smarter predictive notifications, and more accurate real-time tracking. The chip's improved neural engine could analyze sleep patterns, heart rate trends, and movement data with greater precision, offering users better coaching and insights. This also opens the door for more ambitious Apple intelligence features, running natively on the watch without needing to constantly ping your iPhone or the cloud. That means faster Siri performance, instant access to relevant health trends, and adaptive coaching based on your past behavior and fitness goals. There's also significant buzz around a potential blood pressure sensor, a feature long anticipated by the health tech community. While it's not guaranteed to arrive with the Ultra 3 due to ongoing regulatory testing, Apple has reportedly made considerable progress in developing a non-invasive sensor that could provide trends and alerts not clinical-grade diagnostics, but actionable insights that help users monitor long-term cardiovascular health. Even if this feature is held for a future model, the Ultra 3 will still be the most health-focused Apple Watch yet, building on its existing ecosystem of ECG, blood, oxygen monitoring, temperature tracking, sleep staging, and advanced heart rate zone training. Battery life is also expected to improve, with estimates suggesting the Ultra 3 could stretch to 50 hours of usage on a single charge. That's a huge win for users who go on weekend hikes, long runs, or overnight camping trips, combined with 
faster charging, and smarter power management. You're looking at a watch that keeps up with you, not one that needs constant recharging. Apple is also expected to refine the hardware design without reinventing it. The 49mm titanium case is likely staying, but we could see subtle improvements like weight reduction, better speaker volume, clearer microphones, and new band materials. There are rumors of fresh band colors and finishes, including solar orange, arctic blue, and volcanic gray, designed to reflect different environments and adventure personalities. These bands aren't just about aesthetics, they also support different activities, from deep sea diving to alpine climbing to marathon training. On the software side, WatchOS 11 will play a huge role in elevating the Ultra 3 experience, deeper. Integration with iOS 19 and Apple Health Plus will allow more seamless data sensing, unified notifications, and dynamic health dashboards. You'll be able to track VO to max over time, get proactive hydration alerts based on sweat and exertion, Receive stress level feedback using a combination of heart rate variability and temperature sensors, and even see mood trends emerge from passive biometric tracking. And of course, the Ultra 3 will sync perfectly with Apple's ecosystem of iPhone, iPad, Mac, and even Vision Pro. Serving as a notification hub, remote control, fitness tracker, and communication tool all at once. But while Apple pushes forward with this cutting edge device, it also finds itself facing the consequences of its past. In one of the most high-profile investor lawsuits of the last decade, Apple has agreed to pay for $190 million to settle a class action case related to revenue disclosures. From back in 2018 and 2019, at the time, Apple CEO Tim Cook had told investors not to worry about iPhone sales in China, citing pressure in other regions instead. Just two months later, Apple shocked the market by slashing its revenue forecast by $9 billion specifically blaming weak Chinese demand. The stock crashed nearly 10% in a single day, and shareholders accused Apple of misleading them to keep share prices artificially high. After years of legal battles, the company has now settled, though without admitting wrongdoing still. The nearly half a billion dollar payout speaks volumes about the cost of corporate silence. It's a sobering reminder that while Apple excels at innovation and secrecy, transparency is also a key pillar of investor trust. As Apple expands deeper into global markets like India, Southeast Asia, and Latin America where price sensitivity and regulation differ from the US being clear with investors. And regulators will be even more important. The Apple Watch Ultra 3 is a manifestation of that evolution. It's a watch that not only tells the time, but helps protect your life, improve your health, guide your workouts, connect you to your loved ones, and serve as an extension of your digital identity. It's ready for desserts, oceans, cities, airports, mountains, and boardrooms. It works when you're disconnected, keeps going when your phone dies, and helps you stay informed when it matters most. Whether you're an ultra marathoner, a first responder, a military operator, or simply someone who wants a smarter connection to your health and schedule, the Ultra 3 is built for you. But while the product looks ahead, Apple's financial headlines remind us all of what happens when clarity is missing from. Communication, that for $190 million payout may be historic in scale, but it's also symbolic. It marks the end of one chapter and the beginning of another where Apple's responsibility is not only to innovate, but also to communicate with accuracy and honesty. So, as we look forward to the September 2025 event, and imagine the moment Tim Cook walks on stage to reveal the Ultra 3 specs, we also understand the deeper layers behind the product. Every spec bump, every sensor, every design choice, these are not just technical upgrades, but strategic moves in a world where users want more than just functionality. They want trust, reliability, innovation, and ethics all in one ecosystem. And Apple, now more than ever, has to deliver on all fronts. The Apple Watch Ultra 3 is not just a device, it's a message. A message that Apple knows where it went wrong, and is showing us exactly how it plans to get it right.